Hey guys, how's it going? Tears back again with another Ultimate Team video, and this one's going to be my first squad builder on FIFA 14. It's a Liga 1 or Liga 1 side, French uh, top division side, and it's I've not actually got that many coins to be completely honest. This is the first squad I've built. You can see there's a squad on the bench as well. We'll do that one a little bit later on in the week, but uh, I've not gone out and spent loads of Microsoft point money on Microsoft points, etc. Like a lot of guys have. So this has been built from uh, the earnings that are made from those welcome packs that we saw in the first ever FIFA 14 video on this channel so uh, basically how this is going to work we're going to do the squad builder this afternoon and then there'll be another video later on this evening probably around about six or seven o'clock with uh, a live com from my first game with it so uh, let's start off and in goal we have Carasso and he's been downgraded to 81 from 83 I think from FIFA 13 but he is now a rare card so uh, 79 diving 79 handling 84 reflexes and 82 positioning are his standout stats he is a decent goalkeeper or at least he was on FIFA 13 so hopefully he'll be able to bring that over to FIFA 14 as well but all of these players by the way still only have the basic chemistry style on them at right back we've got Fanny 85 pace 76 defending 72 heading uh, another really really strong player in the Liga 1 uh, my go-to right back for that league actually Pacey and crucially with FIFA 14 he's strong as well as fast so hopefully he'll be able to do a very good role for us at right back. At centre back we're going to have Abidel, 64 pace, 79 defending and 72 heading. Uh, not the best heading but he is tall so hopefully that will help when it comes to uh, winning those aerial challenges and then alongside him we're going to have Alex, not the fastest at 55 pace but again really really strong, 79 defending, 86 heading, brutal in the air and of course headers are overpowered at the minute as I'm recording this EA haven't brought a patch out yet although they are planning to bring a patch out for heading and finesse shots so uh, that might be up by the time you see this that might not but uh, at left back we're going to have Bedimo been downgraded from 76 to 75 and is now a non-rare from a rare 81 pace at 76 to earning 74 heading probably one of the best left backs though in Liga 1 there isn't really that much to choose from and as we push forward into the midfield we've got two central defensive midfielders the left side we've got Gonlon 67 pace 80 defending 75 heading and 72 passing decent uh, hopefully going to be really really strong in the tackle not the fastest so uh, I'm going to be looking for him to hold back slightly and uh, maybe not push too far forward and get himself out of position because he's not going to be able to get himself back into position at the right central defensive midfield with the spot we've got Rio Mavu but I would like to have Matuidi but he's just too expensive for me right now 66 pace 78 passing 79 defending and 72 heading again another tall player quite strong and it will be good in the tackle so hopefully those two defensive midfielders will just sit and uh, be able to block the uh, the through balls etc to the uh, opposition strikers and in the midfield we've gone for the 4-2-3-1 with the two wider players a left mid and a right mid as opposed to three central attacking midfielders on the left hand side we've got Andre Ayew from uh, Marseille 82 pace 82 dribbling 72 78 rather passing 72 shot and 84 heading which is surprising actually I didn't realize he was that good in the air so hopefully he can do the job out on the left hand side cutting inside putting the balls in towards Bafatin Bigomis who we've got up top and then on the other side we've got Paye was a left sided player last year now a right mid 81 pace 79 shots 77 passing 83 dribbling so hopefully he can be very very effective on that right hand side whipping in the balls in as well at Cam sat just behind Gomis is uh, Cabela obviously had a team of the season last year I would like Matur uh, Macho Valbuena, he's just too expensive for me right now with the rest of the players that I've bought 80 pace, 80 dribbling, 70 passing, he's not the best player stat wise but hopefully he'll be able to just do a job in the game that we're going to play in just a few moments and then 73 pace 80 shot, 78 heading and 75 dribbling are the standout stats for our main striker, Bafatim Bigomis he is big, he is strong he is very very good with the ball at his feet so hopefully he'll be able to do the job for us up top and that is going to wrap this squad builder video up guys so please do feel free to leave the video a like if you could be so kind of course subscribe if you haven't and be sure to come back again you'll see in your sub boxes around about six or seven o'clock this evening we all have a live com from this squad so thank you very much for watching guys and i will see you next time